Swinray Machine Environment Engineering Company, hereafter called Swinray, is an owned subsidiary company of China Shipbuilding Industry Company Limited, CSIC. Swinray is engaged in research, design, manufacture, engineering, and project contraction of corrosion control and water treatment technologies, as well as products. With its headquarters located in Qingdao, Swinray is an integrated engineering company specialized in corrosion control, anti-fouling technologies, and has successfully undertaken sodium hydrochloride generation projects for 12 nuclear power stations and more than 100 power plants, chemical plants, vessels, and marine platforms. Swinray's ball chlor ballast water management system is developed on the basis of land-based electrolytic technology. Principle of this system is to electrolyze seawater onboard directly to produce high concentrated sodium hypochlorite solution for disinfection. Swinray owns the independent intellectual property rights of the core components. Swinray ball chlor ballast water management system has been granted final approval at IMO's International 61st MEPC conference in September 2010. And was granted type approval by China Classification Society in January 2011. Principle of Ball Chlor TM BWMS is mainly consisted of three procedures: filtration, disinfection, and neutralization. During ballasting, ballast water is filtrated by an automatic back flushing filter. Marine organisms larger than 50 micrometers will be removed during this process. Then a side stream of filtered blast water flow to electrolyzing unit to generate high concentrated oxidant, mainly sodium hypochlorite solution, which will be injected back into main ballast stream to provide effective disinfection to meet D2 discharge standard. Active oxidant will remain in ballast tank for a certain period of time, preventing regrowth of microbes. During deballasting, ballast water will be discharged directly, without repeating disinfection. TRO, total residual oxidant, sensor installed at the outlet of deballasting pipe will closely measure the concentration level of active oxidant. If TRO level is higher than 0.1 ppm, neutralization unit will be operated automatically. The neutralizer will be injected into the deballasting pipe. If TRO Concentration is lower than 0.1 ppm. Ballast water will be discharged to the sea directly, and system not be operated. There are three major components in ball chlor ballast water management system: filtration unit, electrolysis unit, and neutralization unit. During ballasting process, ballast water should flow through an automatic back flusher filter. Firstly, after ballast pump. During filtration, seawater flow into filter housing via inlet flange. Some of the unfiltered water flow into the upper section of the filter by the vertical tube between two filter mesh inserts, and reverse to the filter mesh inserts. This means that the water flows into the filter inserts from opposite directions, then organic and inorganic particles larger than 50 micrometers being separated in the inside of filter candle, and clean ballast water flow out through the outlet of the filter. When the pressure drop between the internal and external of the filter mesh rise to a set value, the filter could operate back flushing process automatically. The filter meshes, which are open at both ends, will be alternately flushed in sequence from above and below. This action doesn't interrupt the normal operation. The flushing arm on the top of the filter rotates by gear motor and covers the upper opening of the filter mesh. Simultaneously. The flushing arm leads the flushing valve opened automatically. As the result of pressure drop inside the mesh, the water will flow through the filter mesh from outside to inside, so the residual impurities and plankton could be flushed out of the filter via the flushing valve. Core component of electrolysis unit is tubular plate type electrolytic cell, which is reliable with mature technology. High efficiency with low power consumption requires installation small space. During electrolyzing process, chlorine was created from electrolyzing seawater on the surface of anodes, which will be dissolved in water rapidly, forming high concentrated sodium hypochlorite solution, and will be injected back into main ballast water pipe after degassing hydrogen during the reaction. 
Sodium hypochlorite is an effective disinfectant solution, could sufficiently kill spores, larvae, pathogens, to meet D2 regulation requirement. Neutralization is used to neutralize TRO. The neutralizer sodium theosulfate is used in this process and could be controlled automatically. The advantages of Swinray Ball Chlor Ballast Water Management System are Side Stream Electrolysis Technology provides the advantages of small installation space and low power consumption as 1 to 2 percent of total volume of ballast water is required for electrolyzing purpose so no change to vessel main pipeline arrangement. Modular design method provides flexible installation options on board both suitable for new ships and existing ships. Low maintenance cost as the life of core components could reach up to ship service life. Only disinfectant ballasting process and disinfection is reliable and effective. Suitable for various type of voyage route include short route. Flexible solutions for fresh brackish water treatment. Swinray is a highly commercialized company, owns advanced product facilities and assembly workshops, skilled technician and workers, modern management system, could have the production ability of 1,000 units annually. Swinray also has established a comprehensive service network all over the world, over 70 countries and region. Could be able to provide clients convenient, sufficient and reliable services and technical support. Win-win development benefit the world. Swinray Marine Environment Engineering Company is now becoming one of the leading world-class companies with its advanced technologies, effective management system and quality products and services.